yes, yes, through his blundering, he's actually going to un unveil it. And I think, apropos that, so she must have come through this room. And then he comes with another idea. Yeah, you and I were in the gun. And then Mrs. Pretto, he just keeps sort of each one. Yes, yes, he's he is. Put it, put it together. He's putting it together. And it's sort of exciting. Da, 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 da. Exactly. Joe Orton, he's arguably the most famous playwright to emerge from Leicester. Joe never saw this play performed. He died a year before it made it to the stage. When Joe was writing this play, homosexuality was illegal, and it feels that sort of many of the themes within the play are a response to the restrictions and the draconian laws of his time. I play Dr. Prentice, who is a psychologist. He's trapped in something of a loveless marriage. There are endless barbaric things that happen in the play. Norton is asking you, what are you actually offended by in all of this? He's just the storm around which all of the other storms are <laughs> circling. The first day is always frightening, then you sit down and you start reading it through. And once you're starting reading it through, then it feels easier. And then it's easier again when you stand up and start you know, working it through on your feet as opposed to just being around a table. And the last play I did was here at the Curve. One flew over the cuckoo's nest and I played Nurse Ratchet. So I'm obviously destined to play parts that are set in lunatic asylums in Leicester. When I first met Nikolai about the job, he said, what do you think of the character? I said, he's mad. And that was just on a kind of skim reading of the play the day before. So um, I don't think he's not mad. <laughs> You're claiming ignorance of the shape and structure of the object sought. In this instance, Sergeant Match is a very ordinary, very PC plod. He bungles his way through, through the show and, and kind of somehow accidentally works out that a crime has been committed. I'd like a hundred quid for the negatives. You've got until lunchtime. Nikolai is just such a fantastic leader, really. On, on day one, he made this incredible speech that I sort of was... I was overwhelmed by how exciting it was. He's so passionate about making theatre, about this theatre and about this play. I couldn't help but get sort of carried away with it. So I think expect to be entertained, but I think also expect to be really challenged. Tie all of that together, Curve, Leicester, Joe Orton, anniversary year, you can't really turn it down.